<laughs> well, this is just perfect. Aren't they just adorable? Hello, friends. I'm currently in possession of some cats. Aren't they precious? So I thought now would be a perfect opportunity to do a little crafting with cocktails while making them some accessories. You can turn this one upside down. He is just so happy to be loved. <laughs> Let's get a beverage. Oh, well, now there's just cats everywhere. And I have this angry orchard rosé, so really I'm living my best life as a crazy cat lady. We're making a harness, and I didn't collect all the materials that I probably should have. Uh, so you'll need some pieces of old bags that you tore apart. Buckles. Okay, let's get this big box of junk out. Oh, oh, it's all coming in one. Well, we still have lots of stuff to play with. Now, I know what you're probably thinking, and that is, hey Grant, why don't you just buy a cat harness online like you do everything else in your life? And my answer to that is, because otherwise there wouldn't be a crafting with cocktails right now. Besides, I want to showcase these adorable kitties. They're just so sweet and I adore them. Oh, oh, there he goes. This one's name is Bear and I have renamed him Muffin while he's in my care. The other one, her name is Carrie, but I have renamed her Mittens. So I have Muffin and Mittens, but collectively before they were the Care Bears. <laughs> So I probably should have looked up what a cat harness is supposed to look like before I did this. I figured I'd just start filming before I fell asleep because again, I've become an old cat lady. I'm pretty sure it goes across the chest here, then around the arms and then connects in the back. Is that right? Just so that you don't choke them when you pull back or pick them up and get them away from a rabid squirrel or something. Oh no, don't take my materials away. I'm gonna get that before he takes it away and hides it. What am I doing? What are you doing? Curious kitty. Oh god, you're stealing stuff again. It, see, I'm so distracted by cats. They're just so cute. Uh, since it's nylon, I'm going to also melt it a little bit so it doesn't fray all over the place. I'm so good at this. More cats. All my old cat lady dreams are coming true. And then we'll grab a cat and test it. Who wants to test out your new magic? Thing. Was it for you? You're more feisty. Bear, come here. Oh, just hid behind the couch. Maybe this won't be as easy as I thought it might be. Hello, baby, come here. This looks ridiculous. Okay, looks absurd. I don't know if it'll work. <laughs> Actually, did I make it too wide? I think I did. Oh, oh, right out of there. Magic, so we know that they're far too curious to stay still. So we've assessed something at the very least. Maybe if I put it on the apple, it's like, ha ha. Nope, that really doesn't work. Oh, you're gonna jump? Don't do it, don't do it. Let's reimagine this a little bit. If all else fails, I'll just make a drunk Amazon purchase of a cat thingy. Muffin, you're easy going, come here. Isn't he just so cute? There we are. It kind of works-ish and give it a very robust-ish. Making clothes for cats is much different than making them for people. Maybe I should just make them something else that's adorable instead. You. All right, let's make them something else instead. Nope, nope, you can't go in the crafting pattern. Wait, where's the other one? Found this laying on the top of everything. It's just some black fabric, so we're gonna make little Hogwarts robes for them, and it's gonna be the cutest thing ever. We're just gonna make a big square to start. I'm not even cutting this out straight. Crafting with cocktails, huh? I can already tell that they're gonna eat this right off of themselves. You are sitting in this box. Isn't this so perfectly cat-like? Sat in my box full of belts and buckles. Oh God, and there's another one that just jumped up. One in there too. Now they're into it, because they're like, I don't want a harness. I want a freaking Harry Potter robe. That should do. I measured around the cat. Just cut a little hole there. Let's make tiny sleeves for it too. Oh, I'm sure you don't want to be a part of that, honey. And you better not get tangled up in this. I'm looking at you, Muffin. Oh, yep, already trying to get tangled up in it. Oh, it's getting into trouble. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, you are so cute. I'm having the most trouble with this. Better drawing. This project is so tiny. I should be using like a regular machine or hand sewing it. It's just so tiny. But that's the good thing about it. Tiny things are adorable. Just like you. Are you gonna get back in the box? You get me curious. Oh no, not that. So adorable. And I attached it like it was a human cape. So that might be a problem later. Okay, so something that I've learned with all sorts of garments is that you wanna make sure that it goes on the right way. Cats are just kinda like jumping and playing. Oh no, please don't knock over the camera. Oh, you're actually trying to knock over the camera. 
Now you're trying to knock over something else. Uh, that's how a cat would defeat the Dark Lord, by knocking a horcrux off the table. This is the worst fabric I could have chosen for this, but it was the only thing that was sitting right in front of me at the time. So my choices were pretty limited. They will probably hate me forever for putting this on them. All right, who wants to be Harry Potter? It's like a really sad Snuggie. But you know what? We're gonna work with it. It's gonna be great. All right, you're the first one I found. Oh. <laughs> Cute, and you hate it. Oh, that is kind of precious, though. <gasps> You're a little wizard. Meow, 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 meow. We very, very successfully made this adorable robe for this adorable cat. Okay, <laughs> freedom. <laughs> just gonna go out all in here and say it's maybe not my best work. Let's just cut slightly bigger armholes and try it on the other cat. So cute, so sweet and so willing for me to put a tiny costume on you. I'm feeling pretty good about this adorable costume on Muffin here. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, oh, get it, get it. <laughs> it's like your people. Now is the true test. If he will ignore wearing it because of the little, oh my God, here they go. Here they go. Yeah, he doesn't care that he's wearing a robe right now. Oh my God, they're trying to catch the snitch. Oh my God, this this is just getting better and better and I am loving every moment of it. I hope that you enjoyed this episode of Crafting with Cocktails where we made this, this adorable little something or rather awkward snuggie for the cats that I'm taking care of. If you enjoyed this episode of Crafting with Cocktails, make sure that you like this video, maybe subscribe to my channel, share it on social media because that's the best way to encourage me to do more stuff. I want to make them tiny hats. Oh my God. Hope to see you next time. Wink. Woo.